What's up, YouTube? It's been forever. Quick life update, because I don't know, when's the last time I made a video? Yes, I did cut off my hair. Um, well, let me start off with, this is May 14th, 2020. The world is just kind of now coming out of a lockdown that's been going on for about two months. <sighs> Lord, um, I've had a birthday. I'm 39. Let's, I cut off my hair in December, so it's, it's been about five months now. I need a haircut, a lineup, a taper, whatever the hell you call it, but uh, because of this virus that the world has experienced, a lot of hairdressers and salons and barbershops are still closed, so it is what it is. Um, right now, weight-wise... I am probably the biggest I have been in my adult life. Uh, probably around 315. And I know we've done this before, but now we have a mission. Okay, it's always a mission to get healthy and look good and blah, blah, blah. Well, not to look good. I look good at any size. Let's not get that fucked up. But to be healthy. But now, this is a mission to look good. Your girl is in a new relationship. And I am also engaged. Whew. The wedding date is set for 2022. Which I'm like two years, plenty of time. But it's 20 months. 20 months. Because we're getting married in February. I got 20 months to do something. And technically, I don't even have 20 months because with reading all these blogs and stuff, everyone is saying that you need to start ordering your wedding dress at least six months is pushing it. And most people say eight months out in case you need alterations and all that stuff. So, a year. I got one year to lose whatever weight I'm going to lose. So I don't look like a big old marshmallow walking down the aisle. Um, I'm sure my fiance wouldn't care because obviously he met me at this size. Well, I take that back. When he met me, I was 15 pounds lighter. My fiance is a cook. Like, not no Waffle House cook. Like, white jacket, hat, cook. <laughs> and, Lord, <laughs> I have been eating. <clears throat> Mm. So, <laughs> Ooh, Jesus, have I been eating? But so, so it's not, you can't keep feeding me like this. And he's tall and skinny, and I'm short and and fluffy. But whatever. So, um, the love of my life, besides my son. That's, okay, whatever. So now we have a mission. We have a goal. To look good in a wedding dress. And I don't know what I'm going to do. I, I think it's too early with the whole outside world to join a gym. Uh, don't really want to be around people. You know, we're, we're supposed to be social distancing and all that. So I definitely don't know if I want to join a gym. Um, I don't have a, a diet in mind. I don't have anything in mind this time. I'm literally starting over. A few weeks ago, I tried the whole keto thing. Mm. I don't know. I, I take... It, it, it worries me that there's a diet where people are losing weight. It works. Obviously, it works because I see a lot of people losing weight. But where... You can't have no fruit. Like, that's supposed to be, like, the healthiest stuff for you is fruits and vegetables. And on the keto, a lot of starchy vegetables, because I love my potatoes, uh, and pretty much fruit, a lot of fruit, um, is, is, is not good for that particular diet. So, the one thing that y'all know, if, if you've been rocking with me, that I've had success in doing is kind of following the whole pescatarian lifestyle. Like I can, well, I like to call it polo pescatarian because on my cheat days, I do like to have 
some fried chicken. I ain't gonna lie. I like fried chicken. I love fried chicken. And don't you come any here with the comments with the stereotypical because I like watermelon too. So whatever. Watch it. But um Yeah, so as long as I can have my seafood, my my fish and shrimp and lobster, scallops and all that stuff, I'm good. Like I could I could cut back on chicken. Um I've cutting out the beef. I've cutting out the the pork, uh, all that other stuff. And I think mainly mainly I was eating seafood, and then I did have some chicken, and I think I might have had some turkey. I don't remember because that was some years ago when I I did it, and I lost twenty pounds in one month. And then it was like I had one cheat day where I just fell off the wagon and 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 uh never got back on so <laughs> but now we have a goal we definitely have a goal and um come along with me for the ride right now right now i need to be asleep because i'm still working third shift so i need to be getting up in a couple hours for work so uh but as far as diet we're going to do pescatarian. As far as exercising, um, you know, we got the YouTube videos. We got, um, you know, I do believe I bought T25, and I've never even opened that box, and that was years ago. So I might open that box, and uh, we have walking. Um, uh, yeah, supplements. There's this new one that everyone's been talking about. Golly, Goli, G-O-L-I. It's like apple cider vinegar gummy shots. And I've actually tried one because my best friend had a bottle. And see, the thing is, when I was doing the whole pescatarian thing, when I lost 20 pounds, I was taking ACV shots back then. But, like, I was taking them in a drink, like, mixing them. And everyone says, oh, it's nasty. To me, it didn't taste so bad. Because I like a uh, hot cider. It tasted like that. Because I would add it to two tablespoons to about six ounces of hot water. And add in some honey. And sip it on down. It didn't, it didn't bother me. I didn't gag. You know, obviously you're not supposed to take ACV straight. Because it could fuck up the enamel on your teeth. Everybody should know that by now. It's an acid. Um... So, but these gummy shots, so I, I, I got a little, I got a little happy and I ordered five bottles. So I'm waiting for those to come and whenever they arrive, you know, shipping is being delayed because of this whole virus thing. I placed my order like a week ago and still haven't even gotten a tracking number. So, uh, but the thing is they said, if I don't get a tracking number within a certain amount of days, then my order is free. So I'm kind of hoping I don't get a tracking number. And, um, yeah. So that is what's going on. That's a nine minute life update. I was trying to go for five. But how y'all been doing? I miss you guys. I miss doing YouTube. There's so much to talk about. Just so much. But I love y'all. Everybody. Hang in there, because I know we are going through some shit. And, um, let's do this again. Peace.